Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix blue screen error with WHEA uncorrectable error in Windows 11 and Windows 10. Stop code 0x000 00124 WHEA uncorrectable error. This is the blue screen of death error in Windows operating system, which is known as Windows hardware error architecture uncorrectable error. This error typically indicates a hardware issue or a critical hardware related error that the system cannot correct. Here are some common causes of WHEA uncorrectable error. Number 1. Issues with the CPU, RAM, motherboard or other critical hardware component can trigger this error. Number 2. Excessive heat can cause hardware to malfunction which can lead to this error. Number 3. Inadequate or failing power supply units can lead to instability. Number 4. Device drivers that are outdated or have become corrupted can cause hardware to behave unpredictably. Number 5. New or incorrect drivers that are incompatible with the hardware leading to this error. Number 6. Not having the latest BIOS or UEFI firmware updates can lead to compatibility and performance issues. Number 7. Improper BIOS settings such as overclocking can cause instability. Number 8. System files that are corrupted can leading to this error. Number 9. Software that incompatible with hardware or operating system can cause this error. Number 10. Problems with storage drive including bad sectors or a failing drive can lead to this error. And number 11. Corrupted file systems can rarely trigger this error. However, don't worry to fix stop code WHEA uncorrectable error follow these tips in order. At first, restart your computer. This can typically be done by pressing the restart button on your computer case. Or for a laptop, press and hold down the power button to force shut down your computer. After few minutes, turn your PC back on by pressing the power button. As the computer begins to restart, enter the BIOS settings by pressing a specific key immediately after the computer starts to boot up. The key to press is often displayed on the screen during startup process. Some common keys are F2, F10, Delete or Escape. Once you are in the BIOS setup utility, look for an option to reset to default settings. This option is often labeled as load default settings, load setup default or restore factory settings. Select this option to reset all BIOS settings to their factory defaults. After setting the BIOS to its default settings, save the changes and exit from the BIOS setup utility. The computer will then restart with the BIOS settings restored to their default state. This step ensures that any custom BIOS settings which might be causing instability or errors are reset to their default stable configuration. After that, check once, hopefully your problem will be solved. If not solved, try the second method. Identify recent changes. This step helps to determine if WHEA uncorrectable error is caused by a new hardware or drivers that might be incompatible with your system or faulty. At first, think back to any new hardware components like RAM, graphics card or external drives or software drivers you currently installed before the WHEA uncorrectable error started appearing. At first, shut down your computer completely. Disconnect the power supply to ensure stability. Now disconnect or remove any non-essential hardware components. This might be include additional RAM sticks, 
external drives and peripherals components. Keep only the essential hardware required for the system to boot. For example, one RAM stick, only the primary storage drive and the CPU. After that, check once, hopefully your problem will be solved. If the system is temporarily unstable, boot into safe mode by pressing a key like F8 or Shift F8 during startup. In Windows, open the Device Manager by pressing Win plus X key combination and select Device Manager. Now find the recent installed drivers and check if there are any driver error in the Device Manager and update device driver for the devices that are showing error. They could be categories like Display Adapters, Network Adapters or Universal Serial Bus Controllers. Now right click on the device associated with the new driver and select uninstall device. Follow any prompts to complete the uninstallation. After removing the hardware or uninstall the drivers, restart your computer to see if the error persists. If not solved, then try this third method. This step ensures that your system has the latest patches, drivers, and improvements which can help to resolve WHA uncorrectable error by fixing known issues and enhancing system stability. I know it is not possible to update from the error screen, but if you somehow manage to successfully boot into Windows with minimum hardware, then press the Windows key on your keyboard, select the gear icon to open settings. In the settings window, find and click on Windows Update. Click the checks for update button. Windows will search for any available updates for your system, including important system patches, drivers update, and other enhancement. If updates are found, they will be downloaded and installed automatically. You might be prompted to review and approve certain updates, especially if they are required significant changes to your system. After the updates are installed, you will likely to need restart your computer to apply the changes. After that, check once, hopefully your problem will be permanently resolved. After trying to boot with minimum hardware settings, for example, one DRAM, less hardware component on your system, if the problem persists, then try this fourth method. By performing this step, you can determine if any essential hardware component are causing the WHA uncorrectable error and take appropriate action to resolve this issue. In order to continue this procedure, you will need a Windows installation media. If you don't have a Windows installation media, then here's a certain tutorial for you. Ok, once you have a Windows installation media, insert it on your computer's USB port and restart your computer. Now go to your PC's BIOS settings or PC's boot manager by pressing a specific key immediately after the computer starts to boot up. Now select your Windows installation media to boot from that. Now click on next and click on repair now. Next, click on Troubleshoot and then select Command Prompt. 
Now type mdscheted.exe and hit enter. Now select restart now and check for problems which is recommended option. Your computer will restart and the Windows Memory Diagnostic tool will run a series of tests to check for memory issues. After the tests are complete, the computer will restart again. You can view the test result by opening the event viewer. And navigate to the Windows log then system. If the memory diagnostic tool does not find any errors, then you will need to test the processor. Now go to Intel website and download the Intel processor diagnostic tool. Follow the installation instruction to install the tool on your computer. Once done, open the Intel processor diagnostic tool and run a full diagnostic test. The tool will perform various checks on your CPU to ensure it is functioning correctly. After checking is complete, the tool will provide a detailed report of the test results. Look for any errors or issues that might be indicate a problem with your processor. If the Intel processor diagnostic tool does not find any errors, then try to test other hardware in the system. For example, if another working hard drive is available, then use it instead. After that, check once, hopefully your problem will be solved. And don't forget to let me know in the comment section. By following these steps, you can identify and repair any file system corruption that might be contribute to WHEA uncorrectable error, although it is rare for this to be the so cause of this error. Here's a detailed tutorial on how to identify and repair any file system corruption. And also this tutorial will help to undo system changes or restoring the system to a previous stable state. So I hope one of this resolution was helpful for you. If you have any question or any advanced guide then please let us know. Please like comment and share we need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.